This is the Sony Alpha 9, and it has a number of very powerful customization features that allow you to adapt to changing scenarios quickly. One of them allows you to instantly override camera settings with a simple button press, and this includes camera settings like shutter speed, aperture, shoot mode, and AF modes. So what I've done here is assigned a bunch of different custom buttons to different AF modes. My main mode right now is lock on AF, expand flexible spot. So you can see I can move it around and place it on this whiskey bottle and initiate lock on AF. And you can see it's tracking the whiskey bottle. It's a little dark in here. However, if I want to instantly go to wide or complete auto mode, because in the moment I, I can't acquire AF using lock on and I just need the camera to take the shot, uh, I can actually hit this AEL button, which I've assigned to wide AF mode, which picks my laptop here. If I want to revert to good old center focus and recompose, I've actually assigned that to AF on. So I can just focus, recompose, even though I'm in AFC, because this override overrides the camera into AFS and center focus point. I've even assigned this uh, button press of the joystick, a downward press of the joystick, to IAF. So now you can see it finds the eye of the model on the screen and tracks it. So how do I do this? Well, you go into the menu, go to custom key for shooting, and then assign a button, any of a number of custom buttons to what's known as recall custom hold. Now you have three of these. You go in, and then here are all the camera functions that you can instantly override. Shoot mode, aperture, shutter speed, drive mode, exposure comp, ISO, metering mode, focus mode, focus area, and AF on. AF on meaning whether or not AF is actually initiated or not. You basically decide if these overrides are going to happen by whether or not there's a checkbox that's checked or not. So to assign different custom buttons to different AF modes, what I did is uncheck everything except focus area and AF on. So that way for this button, I can just assign wide, zone, center, any of the um, AF area modes to this button. So I chose wide here and make sure that AF is actually activated. For the AF on button, what I did was I also went to focus mode, check that because my camera is always in AFC. That's where it focuses the fastest and change this to single shot AF, focus area to center and AF on. And now this button becomes center focus and recompose. So this is a very powerful way to quickly adapt to changing scenarios in case you need a different AF mode without ever actually having to go into the focus area menu system, which is a little more cumbersome. Now, this is a powerful customization feature that we've seen in high-end DSLRs, so it's great to see it come to the Sony Alpha 9 professional series of cameras. This is Rishi from DP Review. Thanks for watching.